pretty much invest into knowledge as much as possible. Soak up everything you can. What's going on guys? It's here, Eddie. This video is actually about a TikTok video that I saw through YouTube from Mr. Saigon, a businessman entrepreneur that lives in Dubai, but he's originally from Germany. But he went to Dubai in the Middle East, and now he's a very successful businessman. This is a video from Mr. Saigon that I just saw, and this is his advice to teenagers all over the world in what they should invest in. So I'm gonna go ahead and play the video so you can see and hear what he has to say. Here's an interesting question. What should teenagers do to earn money? Don't put so much pressure on yourself. I don't think as a teenager you should be worried about making money. You should pretty much invest into knowledge as much as possible. Soak up everything you can. Don't think about becoming rich or whatever. You're a teenager. Enjoy your life. Go to school. Learn. Learn as much as possible. Have good people around you. That's so valuable. Good people. And then uh, the rest will fall into place. Regarding what Mr. Saigon said from Dubai, this businessman regarding teenagers investing in knowledge instead of becoming rich, I think that in one way I agree because knowledge, as he says, knowledge, it's good. And I agree because knowledge, it's power. The more we know, the better we're gonna be in this world. Either through books, through videos on YouTube talking about finance, investments, real estate, all these good things that can help us get the knowledge we need to be better and better in this world. The more knowledge we get, the better. Because all that knowledge, we're gonna have it right in our minds. The more we learn, the more knowledge we have, the better. And this is 100% true. You can read finance books, investment books. You can go on YouTube and search for this type of information so we can get the knowledge. Also through people that are very successful. There's a lot of kids that have to work in order to provide help for themselves and their families. And this is true. Everyone's financial situation, it's different. Regarding Mr. Saigon's video, yes, it is true. We need knowledge. And the more knowledge we have in our minds, the better. His video is about teenagers, but I think that we all need knowledge. From kids to teenagers to adults, we all need knowledge, especially financial knowledge because financial knowledge is good. So because we all need this financial knowledge, I'm going to show you some books. Hopefully these books you can go get at a library, you can buy, and these books are really good. And I'm going to show you these books right now. And this is all I have to do with Mr. Saigon's video regarding knowledge. But since he's a businessman, he's talking about knowledge. And what better to know more about finance, business, 
investments. So now, Showtime. I'm going to show you this financial books. The first book that I ever bought is this book, The Snowball, from Mr. Warren Buffett, the greatest investor of all time here in the USA. This book, The Snowball, is about Mr. Warren Buffett's whole life and how he became rich and a multi-billionaire over the years. That's what the snowball is about. It talks about how he started through investment, how he became a millionaire, then a multi-billionaire over time. That's a good book, 100%. I recommend. The other book is The Financier. This is a real good book also. And what this book is about, a kid, he was a kid that was born in the 1800s. He learned about business, about money, about the stock market, and what to do when the stock market crashes. And then, because of the stock market crashes, he took the opportunity, he had the financial knowledge to know what to do and because of the stock market crashes, he became a multi-millionaire by investing. This is a good book. The Financier, 100% I recommend. Another financial book is Rich Dad, Poor Dad. I recommend 100%. It's really good. It is by Mr. Robert Kiyosaki. What this book is about I have a video of Rich Dad and Poor Dad if you're interested in checking it out for more information. What this book is about, it teaches investments, how to manage your cash or income on what to do. It teaches the poor, the middle class, and what the rich do, and what the people that were not rich, that are now rich, what they did to become rich and get richer. This is what this book is about. Rich Dad, Poor Dad. It is a real good book and you will learn a lot. It's a great financial book. Regarding going back to Mr. Warren Buffett, we all know that Mr. Warren Buffett buys companies through stocks or he buys the whole companies. Regarding business, Regarding investing, the next book has to do a lot on how Mr. Warren Buffett got so rich over a long period of time. And this next book has a lot to do with Mr. Warren Buffett and how he makes so much money every three months. This is 100% a great book. Must own, must read. In fact, they all are. The book all about dividend investing is about buying business corporations that pay dividends. And these dividends are paid from the company to the shareholders. Imagine that you own 100,000 shares of Chevron. 
This is a dividend paying company or a dividend paying business corporation. Chevron pays $1.50 per share as a dividend. If you own or are those that own shares of Chevron, this means that if you multiply 100,000 shares times $1.50, this comes up to $150,000 every three months. A year, this would be $600,000. This is a lot of money. So when opportunities come, that the markets come down and stock prices come down, you can take advantage and invest in stocks and invest in dividend stocks and just leave them for a long period of time, just like Mr. Warren Buffett done. And this is what this book is about, all about dividend investing. I recommend 100%. The next book, it's about stock splits secrets. What this book is about is when the company stock price is really high, corporations, executives decide to cut the prices in half, they want for other people to invest in the company. When they do a stock split, whoever owns stocks from this corporation, this means their stocks will double or triple or quadruple, depending on the amount of shares that the investors have, depending on the stock split. But also, it's an opportunity for everyone to buy at a lower price not only for investors that already own stocks, but also for other people that want to buy shares at a low price. So this is a huge opportunity. Now the dividends will also come down, but you will get paid dividends. And over time, the dividends once again will increase, which means you will be making a lot more money or a lot more cash and this is what this book is about stock split secrets it's a hundred percent good because if you own stocks or dividend stocks this will benefit the investor a lot <laughs> the last book it is oil or petroleum this book it's really good a hundred percent i recommend because this talks about petroleum and the use of petroleum all over the world this is a graph of the proven oil reserves in the world. This is the oil consumption by country in 2007. This is a really good book to read. All these books are great, in my opinion, in finance because they're really good. They're all really good to read give you that financial knowledge that we all need. There might be more, that I know there's a lot more books. In my opinion, these financial books are really good. I recommend. This is because financial knowledge gives us power. The more we read about finance, the better. We're gonna have more power. This video, it's about regarding Mr. Saigon from Dubai, this entrepreneur, this outstanding businessman he was also poor then he went to dubai over the years he became a multi-billionaire all because of an idea that presented to him when he went to sell his car he had issues by waiting so long at this place so an idea popped in his mind he decided to take action to make that instead of people waiting for a long time like he was waiting to wait less. So now he opened this business, he's doing great. He's helping other business people too. This video, it's about regarding Mr. Saigon's TikTok video about teenagers, but it's not about teenagers to me, it's about everybody. We all need the knowledge of reading and knowing but we all know that everybody's life, financial situation, it's different. What we need is to learn, to have the knowledge. The more knowledge we have, the better. Because knowledge, it's power.
power, 100%. <laughs> this is it. If you have any questions or comments, let me know in the comment box below and I'll do my best to answer you back. If you enjoyed this video and saw value, make sure to smash, smash, smash that like and subscribe button. Make sure to share the video, hit that like button and get those likes up. Thank you for watching. This is Eddie. See you in the next video. <laughs>